main reasons to buy a drone is to get cinematic looking footage when you fly, but learning to fly and shooting at the same time can be hard. That's where the 3DR Solo comes in. It's a regular looking drone, but has a couple of cool features when you're flying it. You can do things like selfie mode, follow mode, or even orbit around a particular structure. So in a satellite view here on the app, you can select a structure you want it to orbit around and simply start the process. It will automatically film it for you. There's an also another option called cable cam. This is where you can set multiple different keyframes during the flight and select each particular one that you want. And then all you need to do is simply choose your start and the end point and anything in between start the drone flying and it will automatically make a pretty cool little film of that particular flight just like you've got a cable camera doing all the work for you. Also the controller itself is pretty simple to use there's a couple of different buttons like A and B buttons like kind of like you find on a video game controller that's kind of what they based it around. You have pitch and your control of course as well as a fly button which you simply need to press and hold to start takeoff and a return to home button. There is also a pause button so you, if there's something going on during your flight you need to pay attention somewhere else you can simply press pause and the drone will start hovering mid-flight so you don't need to worry about it. The 3DR Solo is compatible with the gimbal that is available for GoPro mounts and it is $999 however the gimbal and the GoPro cost extra. If you want to find out more about the 3DR Solo visit CNET.com.